Hello Prairie Point teachers and especially new teachers to our building. I wanted to show you where we curate resources and tools for you and for your students. And that is on our library website. You can get to this site um, by typing in www.pointlibrary.org into your URL bar and please bookmark it because we do update it often and we want you to use it and help us make it as useful to you as possible. There's just a few things on the website that I wanted to show you really quickly. To get to our library catalog on the website, you would click right there on the Destiny Discover catalog. You and your students can all log in to the catalog. You can search without logging in, but if you log in, you will have access to a lot of digital uh, resources there like ebooks and audiobooks and um, uh, other digital tools. Some of our digital um, ebooks can be used by the whole class at one time if they have this infinity sign on them. So there's um, things that you and your students could just read for pleasure. There's also professional resources and um, uh, books that you could use in your curriculum potentially. And if there's ones that we don't have that you would like us to get, let me know and uh, we can probably get those too. So you can log in using your Prairie username and password by clicking uh, right there in the upper right. And then once you get logged in, you'll have information about your account and you'll actually be able to check out um, the digital uh, resources. All right, let's go back to the home page. Um, another thing I wanted to show you was uh, something to read is a place where you can find uh, books to read or uh, e-magazines or you can encourage your uh, students to do that. So on the Find Books page, there's lots of resources that can help you and your students find good books to read or to use in your um, uh, classroom. And then on the Flipster e-magazines, we subscribe to uh, I'm not sure the exact number, approximately 10 um, digital magazines. A lot of these are for um, um, students for leisure reading or just pleasure reading, but you could also potentially use them in your class. And um, there, it is uh, possible for all of your students to access the magazine at one time. So you could use it as a, like a class set of a of a magazine to bring reading into your curriculum in a different sort of um, format. So those are our Flipster e-magazines. And you can see it looks just like the pages of the print magazine. All right, back to the website. Um, also, we have um, under do research. There is a page for um, copyright friendly images and music. These, this is a good place for your students to find images and music that they might be using in a digital product for your um, class. Also databases are um, where students can do research, but there's also some teacher resources. I'm in the process of redoing this, uh, updating it for a new year, so I'm going to link lots of other resources down here, but for now, um, there's a place to find professional resources as well on the um, Do Research Databases page of our website. Finally, um, we have always kept sort of a little um, collection of all the class websites that teachers use in the building. If you plan to have a class website, um, please send me the link and I will add it to our gallery. A lot of students find that a useful place to figure out how to get to your class website if they've forgotten or um, didn't bookmark it. So um, that's a quick overview of our website. Please let me know if there's anything I can uh, do to make the site more useful to you or any resources that you uh, would recommend that we add. Um, I'm looking forward to a great year.